One Sarasota family is grateful to be alive after firefighters discovered deadly gas throughout their home. The unexpected culprit, an electric golf cart charging in their garage. ABC 7's Erica Jackson joins us live from the Sarasota County Fire Department to share how this family nearly escaped death. Erica. Jacqueline Scott, good evening. That family didn't even realize there was a colorless, odorless gas floating through their home. They evacuated within a few hours, but if they waited any longer, they may not be here to share their experience. This five-year-old golf cart nearly killed Farrell Mars and her family. And this carbon monoxide detector likely saved their lives. It could be a false alarm, but it, more importantly, it could be something that's deadly. Mars says she learned her carbon monoxide detector was out of date last week. So when she heard the backup alarm sound, she took the warning seriously. We have no gas in the house. There is no gas. So why in the world? we would have carbon monoxide going on. It makes no sense to us. The problem wasn't carbon monoxide. Sarasota County's hazmat team and firefighters blame the family's golf cart for producing a deadly hydrogen and sulfur dioxide based gas. And you don't know how much you've ingested. You don't know how much is in your bloodstream. We do see this uh, with golf carts where people are charging their golf carts in garages. Chief Michael Regner says owners of older golf carts need to be cautious while charging the batteries in an enclosed space. He says if the battery becomes overcharged, it can give off hydrogen gas. The uh, charging system that they have are not ones that turn off once the battery is charged all the way. I don't want to use this anymore. It scares me. Now Mars doesn't want to take her main form of transportation out of her driveway. She's epileptic and can't drive a car for safety reasons. Although the four wheels sent her and six other people in her house to the ER, she's grateful she can warn others about her near death experience. It happened to us and it can happen to you too. The National Golf Cart Association recommends charging your golf cart outside, but if you have to do it inside, make sure there's ventilation. If you notice your carbon monoxide detector is going off, evacuate immediately and call 911. Reporting live in downtown Sarasota, Erica Jackson, ABC 7, your Suncoast News.